Hello, this is Russ Walden with Father's Heart Ministry, and this is the Daily Prophetic Word. The Father says today, exercise the faith that I've given you by the power of my spirit I've placed within you. My dunamis power down on the inside of you, it's churning, it's bubbling, it's coming to the surface to bring forth an explosive manifestation of my goodness and my faith, my deliverance and my transitional strength to bring you out of the place of difficulty and struggle into a place of answered prayer beyond your expectations. My power is like a tool a divine bulldozer clearing away the obstacles that have held you back, a Holy Ghost howitzer clearing the landscape as your potential is being reshaped according to my promise and not according to the constraints and limitations that you have felt binding you down. What seemed like lost hopes are now reviving, like dry bones, in Ezekiel's vision. Here's the key. I've placed a word of command within you. Speak it. Declare your heart. Unleash a torrent of faith-filled pronouncements. This is where genuine faith separates itself from empty talk. Cry out with faith and watch what I accomplish in return. This is your turning point. It's about trust. Where does your loyalty lie? Recall your commitment to me when you gave up your life to my kingdom? You promised to do anything and to go anywhere. Today I cash in on that promise. I won't let you live another day without the fullness of joy that is your birthright. Now about gifts. Make room for my gifts on the inside of you. Something extraordinary is happening within you regarding your talents and anointing for ministry purpose. It's bubbling up like a pot of coffee brewing. The aroma fills the air, signaling you it's time to come to the table. The table is set. Your name card is placed. But I see another setting where someone isn't coming around, but rather choosing to continue to live their own life, to go their own way, rejecting the salvation that I've held out to them all the day long. Stop waiting on them. Remember Samuel, who stopped waiting for King Saul's repentance? There are relationships you've held faithfully on to, but it's time to let go and let me handle it. Do you trust me? Let me take it from here, says the Father. Your job is to embrace and pursue the glory that is raining down on you this day, regardless of who joins you in the journey. Now what do you do with the word like this? You mix it with faith. You make a choice to remember that Jesus said that the kingdom of God does not come with observation. So passively observing a word or pondering a word will get you nowhere. You need to take the word and activate it by your faith. And one of the most powerful ways to get an abject unbelief or absolute faith is in the area of giving. Mix this word with some faith by sowing into its very fulfillment in your life. You see, it, the faith that it takes to give into a prophetic word is equivalent to the faith involved in bringing that very word to pass in your situation. Ask me how I know. Act now. Because your response time in giving is a metric for God's timing in bringing this breakthrough to pass in your situation. Go to fathersheartministry.net, click on the donation button, and let your faith soar. The mailing address is Father's Heart Ministry, P.O. Box 14127, Springfield, Missouri, 65814. Or you can text the word PROFIT. 244321. If you use Cash App, dollar sign prophetic now. If you use Zelle, prophetic now at gmail.com. I want you to know that I am here 
to be the prophet in your life. Second Chronicles 20:20 20, 20 says, "If we believe the prophet, so shall you prosper." I want you to notice how we misread that verse so much. We we think it says believe the prophecies. It doesn't say believe the prophecies. It says believe the prophets, so shall you prosper. And how can you believe in the prophet unless you have one in your life? And that's what I'm here for. I want to remind you that the sky isn't falling. I don't care what you see on the news and on the media. The sky isn't falling. The kingdom in your life, the kingdom is coming. This is Russ Walden with Father's Heart Ministry. Visit us at again at fathersheartministry.net and take advantage of all the resources that are there to put you over in life. God bless you. Now what do you